Connie and Curtis. That was the party, guys, where obviously, I mean, I don't know if she had a mom now thinking back because okay. she was a girl. There were boys and girls at the party, yeah. and we watched the movie Rambo. Whoa. And you were eight? <laughs> and eight or nine. Oh, uh, Rambo. Uh, first Blood, the first Rambo, had already been out, and I had seen that, and all of us boys had seen it. Mm-hmm. And her dad says, all right, time for the movie, and the movie was Rambo. <laughs> As parents now, when you are going to be going to a movie or watching a movie at a party like that, do you like let the parents know what movie you're watching, or do you just err on the side of caution and air, watch such a timid movie that we, nobody would be upset. We will go timid mm-hmm. only because Haley's first birthday party that she ever went to in kindergarten, uh-huh. she came home <laughs> white knuckled and like crying and we're like, oh, what, what happened? They had watched the movie Beetlejuice. Which that is, movie is creepy. It's mm-hmm. so it's scary. Yeah. And, and they were five. <laughs> Five years old. She's like, yeah, we watched this movie, and she's explaining it, and I'm like- I hated that movie. I said, movie. was it called Beetlejuice? And she says, yeah, I think so. She was five? She was five. It was kindergarten, and that mom and dad showed oh. Beetlejuice, and then Katie and I uh, had not had a birthday party for any of our kids yet. Yeah. We only had the one, maybe right. maybe a second little tiny baby, and we were like, that's weird. Let's not, let's not ever be those parents. Right. Right? Yeah, that's- I mean, that's goofy. Do you think they knew what Beetlejuice was, or they just, they just saw weird, stilty cartoon characters? I think they knew what it was, and maybe it was like one of their kids' favorite movies. Hmm. Like, we have friends who will talk about their favorite movies, like their kids love this movie, and right. we're like, we would never show our kids that movie. Yeah, but remember when you took them to that PG-13 movie dumb that and, was so dumb and naughty? Dumber, dumb and Dumber 2. <laughs> Uh, you apologize to them afterwards. We felt so <laughs> bad. <laughs> Dumb and Dumber Oops. 2, not a movie for kids. Uh-huh. No. Nope. So bad. We I had, still haven't even seen it. We had seen Dumb and Dumber 1 and loved it. Like, all the kids loved it. Yeah. But now, I mean, it was just raunchy. It was right. dirty. We were right. flipping through the uh, the TV channels at the hotel mm-hmm. over the weekend. We had HBO and a couple other HBO channels. And American Pie was on. And you, we all know that American Pie is very dirty, right? right? So it's on, and <laughs> I stop. So I stop, and I'm watching it, and Kitty goes, keep going. I'm like, okay. <laughs> Isn't that the movie? Didn't your sister watch that with your mom? With my mom in the theater. <laughs> oh, that'd be creepy. Uh, my sister was in high school. Oh, uh, I was out of the house. My sister and my mom went to go see the summer blockbuster that was uh-uh. American Pie. You don't ever go to the movies with your parent. You Unless sh- it's a G rated movie. You shouldn't, right? Embarrassing. But it opened up a whole new relationship. I would want to watch that now with my mom. It opened up a whole new relationship for them now. I, I bet. Mean, now they they talk about things like... Let's make pie. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> weird. Man, just a... It's weird. I can't imagine watching that. No. For some mom. reason, I saw the full Monty with my parents <laughs> oh, in the theater. Oh, Steve! <laughs> what am- happened? Whatever year that came out, I didn't even know. I was, was this, pretty young. Were you at like the dollar theater and they were like, ah, oh, this looks really good? Wow. There's a uh, theater in um, Novi where I'm from yeah. and uh, they do like uh, some like foreign films and some other stuff. Okay. And so it's a British movie. And uh-huh. so they thought, hey, let's go take Steve to the nice How bad foreign, can that be? Yeah, foreign theater. Let's see. It came out in 1997. I would have been 14 at the time. Oh. Okay, eighth grade Steve. <laughs> now, oh. I, I, I saw the full Monty. With yeah, parents. literally. Yeah. I have never seen it, but do those guys actually get naked? Yeah, at the very end of the movie. You they s- do the full Monty. All the guys line up, and yep. Do you see their fronts? Yep. <laughs> <laughs> You saw fronts? And it's wonderful. Wow. Yeah. I, and you could tell because the whole movie's leading up to it. And the whole time I'm getting your all sin- sweaty hands. Like, oh, jeez. Oh, is this going to happen? <laughs> your hands. Oh, my God. Wow. Oh, you must have been dying. Yeah, so, that, was, that was weird. So you could tell that they were going to drop everything. Oh, yeah. That, the whole movie led up to that final scene. Oh, wow. What did they say to you when you walked out, your mom and dad? Anything like <laughs> it was just kind of like was it quiet? Wow. Yeah, just like those awkward like, oh, well, that happened. <laughs> <laughs> so they did not apologize to you, like, like no. walking out of Dumb and Dumber Two. Katie <laughs> leaned down to Charlotte and Elizabeth, oh who what was that? That was two years ago. So they were in third and fourth grade, yeah. and she said, "Guys." I am sorry about that. <laughs> we should not have come to this movie. And Haley is like, well, that's hilarious. Let's go again. Connie and Curtis.